A long time ago, in the mystical land of Sanford, there was a beautiful woman lost in a forest, starving with nothing to eat or drink. I'm lost in this forest, starving with nothing to eat or drink. She stumbled her way through the forest before making it to a small, run-down shack. The door looked as if the house was made for only very small people. Wow, that door looks as if that house was made for only very small people. Hoping that food would be inside of the little home, the woman opens the unlocked door and crawls inside. The first thing she sees is a bright green apple sitting on top of a small table. That apple looks delicious, and I am beyond hungry. I must take a bite out of that succulent fruit. Like a rabid dog, the woman takes chunks left and right out of the apple. She continues to maul the fruit until she comes to a sudden stop. She doesn't feel so good. She falls to her knees with the apple in hand. Suddenly, the door flew open. Four dwarves stand in the doorway, shocked at what they see. Woman, what have you done? Look, she ate my apple. That was my apple, dog. She ate it. She ate it. There was something, dog. That apple is going to cure Dopey's Turner Syndrome by giving her a Y chromosome. You ate my life's work. Yeah, you ate his life. You ate his life. Ah! Oi, you gas-looking dosser! Get up off of me before I knock you up in your teeth! Oh no, you must have Kleinfelter syndrome. The apple worked, it added a Y chromosome to your XX chromosomes. If you ain't cutting me, you best fix these himes! We should be able to fix this in a way that would be able to cure everyone. We must transfer your extra Y chromosome to Dopey, thus giving her her missing chromosome. Is that going to hurt, Doc? Doc, I don't want it to hurt, Doc. Doc, don't do it. Quiet, kid. It won't hurt. I'm Doc. This is Dopey. This here is Sleepy, and Happy's in a corner over there. That brutal Chysler's name is Happy. He's the saddest fella I've ever seen. It's no use. We're all going to perish in the end. Ignore him. He's suffered a lot of trauma after Grumpy lost his temper in the mine one day. Crazy kid blew sky high, along with Sneezy and Bashful. Happy's left with depression and a hint of PTSD. Life is a social construct. <laughs>
Sleepy jumped out of bed and grabbed his special golden glove from his locked chest. He ran outside and saw the smoke cloud from the distance. The mine had been completely destroyed. I must undo all that has been done. Everything must be reversed. Balanced. You can't do nothing about it now. You chose to blow up the mine, Grumpy. But you should have gone for the house. He can't do blah 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 blah.